From the very beginning, Brian Koberger has been eager to be exonerated. He is accused of the brutal killings of the four Idaho students, and is the only suspect. However, there could potentially be a loophole for Brian now, that could jeopardize the case against him. New documents were released, and Idaho prosecutors have revealed an internal affairs investigation into an officer in the Brian Koberger case. They have disclosed the existence of a Giglio Brady list that could potentially affect the ongoing criminal proceedings. Under Brady law, investigators are responsible for disclosing exculpatory information to defense counsel. Meanwhile, Giglio material conveys information that could potentially indicate that a witness is not credible. We also saw Brian Koberger's family stand with him, and they even attended his first court appearance. His mother looked shattered, while holding on to his sister. I know that his one sister worked as an actress, and the other one as a school counselor. It is now being reported that both sisters have been let go from their jobs. They were let go despite not even visiting him in jail. It's said that Brian's family never visited him in jail, but have spoken to him over the phone. As time approaches for Brian's preliminary proceedings, I'm getting nervous if this new information could be a problem for the prosecution. I hope they have something so solid that it puts all reasonable doubt to rest. Something from the crime scene at his apartment that can't be explained away. If Brian did this, then he should not get away with it.